wallowing in self-pity and misery. We're going, oh, I hope they take us back. <laughs> God, what I wouldn't give to see their stupid faces. What is it? Oh, it's gonna use her ability. You don't understand what I did to deserve this. Nothing. Nothing. Stress eating. Because women act on emotion and not logic. Precisely. Oh no. We're trying to solve the great mystery of the female species. That mystery will never be solved. No, Lucas, no. He's gonna pass gas. Uh, Abort 11. When I say three inches, three. It's not my calm down. Mike's not here. Billy, what's he doing? No. Don't be afraid. He's on the floor. No viewers. Talking to someone. No, he knows. Or it knows. That is not music. That is the sound of destiny. I wow. The future, and I've seen that today is a new day. A day free of girls. What is What? Happening? Oh, look who it is. We need to talk. Yeah, we do. I haven't been stood up like that since Alice Gilbert in the ninth grade. Damn. Remembers that? What are you doing? I just want to get this exactly right, okay? You stand me up. No phone call, no apology, because you had to go to Scott Clark's house. Yeah. <laughs> you've outdone yourself, Joyce. You really have. No, you've outdone yourself. Feeling butt hurt. Listen, Hopper. Scott, to build a machine like this, you need resources. You need scientists, you need funding, tens of millions of dollars. Joyce. She knows. Coincidence, Hopper, it has to be them. Joyce, stop. It has to be the lab. It is impossible. What the hell are you doing? I need to borrow these. No, you're not going back there. Joyce. Joyce, you're not going back there. And now you're going to follow her. Yeah, that's not normal at all. I know how it sounds, but... But you've got proof! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fellas, you gotta admit it's a hell of a headline, right? Hawkins rodents prefer poison. Nut job tells all. <laughs> uh, guys, that's enough. I think this is... big. Bigger than one article. In fact, I think this has got to be a book. The Mysterious Case of the Missing Fertilizer. A Nancy Drew mystery. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on. I was hoping. Besides, I don't even get why you're looking at girls anyway. You have the perfect one right in front of you. Seriously, if you say Robin again. Robin. Robin, Robin it's Robin, true. Robin, 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 no, Robin. It's a horde of juju zombies. Sir Mike, your action. So that's what they're going to call those zombies when we go back to the Upside Down. I attack with my arm. Look, my arm. Yeah, they're not into it. The zombie. Maybe we should just call them. We can do that. I think so. Yeah. What would we say? We'll say nothing. The Kuazar tribe still need your help. You're destroying everything, and for what? You could swap spit with some stupid girl. Elle's not stupid. It's not my fault you don't like girls. Damn. I'm not trying to be a jerk, but we're not kids anymore. I mean, what did you think, really? That we were never gonna get girlfriends? That we are just gonna sit in my basement all day and play games for the rest of our lives? Yeah. I guess I did. I really did. Well, uh, he could have handled that a we'll bit on. better. She's not here. Failed on me today. What is this? You girls want a reward or something? No. Nope. We're just good Samaritans. Hence the name of the episode. <gasps> Yo. <laughs> oh, 
Just like the ice in Billy's damn tub. Anybody home? Like, I don't think they are working in there at all. Ah, uh, the same place where freaking Bob died. Damn, camera's still working, huh? She gonna just attack anyone who has a duffel bag. Ah, uh, slip a dance. Yeah. Guess that's a clue. Have a nice day. Yeah, you too. Smart check. Really, guys? There it is. Said they wanted proof, right? So let's give it to him. A rubber rat? No, the real rat. Driscoll's rat. You said yourself it looks sick. We can take it to an animal control center. They can run some blood tests. Yeah, but that rat went boom and it just slid it away. It's never over, man. I want you to feel like this can still be your home. What? You didn't think I'd find out about that? Gary called me. He said he's fixing up your house to put it on the market. Oh, she's planning on moving? You have people that know you've been to. You have people that care about you. No. Will! Will, I'm sorry, man, alright? I was being a total asshole. Please no, you were. <laughs> Gonna regret that later on. Cole, what are you doing? Maybe she fell. She Maybe she got eaten by that thing that was downstairs. Uh, are they going to find exactly? Is this Yo. Damn it, I made noise. Ah, oh, that Russian dude. The hell? Yo. We just wanted to make sure everything was okay. Okay. Why wouldn't it be okay? Where is she? I'm sorry. Where is who? Well, they're a little burnt. I'm sorry. Uh. This is Mr. Maxine, and I'm sorry. I did not quite catch your name. So that is that actually oh. Heather though? They're fresh out of the oven. Don't eat that cookie, damn it. Yes, remembering who Eleven truly is. We'll get in those vibes again. Okay? He's back. Finally tells him on a third episode. The only little light head is though. It's all that wine. Lightheaded. Um, Yo, they put something in the food. Aw, oh, damn. Aw, oh, damn. 
I'm really sorry about this, Daddy, but it'll all be over soon. I promise. Damn. Whoever is editing down these damn episodes, they're doing a magnificent job. Because these cliffhangers don't even want... Because I'm supposed to, like, stop watching by episode two. Like, try to do two episodes a day. But, like, I don't know how many episodes I'm going to be watching. Because the way how they keep freaking ending, it's like, I gotta watch the next one. You have freaking episode one, freaking cliffhanger, Billy being dragged. It's episode two, the Heather situation. And just seeing how this episode ends with Heather, that's not really Heather, and Billy, that's not really Billy, drugging the parents. And then whatever happened to Heather is pretty much going to happen to them. Like, damn. What is the true end game here? I gotta freaking know. But good thing, you know, Max and Eleven are on the case, though. But while they are pretty much investigating and she was losing her abilities, you know, try to locate Heather. And but the first time it was Billy, like, yeah, they got spotted. And near the end of the episode, you know, the mind flare realized that, wait a minute, they look familiar now. And he pretty much, if not he, but it figured out. Like, wait a minute, you're the individual that pretty much, you know, <laughs> tried to get rid of me, but they pretty much just learned this episode that they truly didn't. You have freaking Will, who's, yup, he's in his damn fields, because hell, his friends are pretty much preoccupied, you know, with the female anatomy. It's understandable, it's a part of freaking life, your friends are, you know, driven by freaking the opposite sex. You are not there yet, hope you'll click, who knows, but... Apparently, you got to be getting vibes since, like, the first episode about uh, something's going on. And now he's like, yo, guys, it's back. You know, and eventually they're going to, you know, go back home and realize that freaking what happened with Joyce and Hopper. Because they were investigating, you know, going back to the freaking lab. At one point, I thought it was like, oh, nothing was going on. But then you see the uh, freaking security camera was still on. I was like, wait a minute. Don't tell me like someone's gonna like, you know, come out and busting open the lab. So maybe just like, you know, keep a surveillance. But got that freaking Russian dude was in there, you know, took whatever information he needed and then pretty much disposes a freaking hopper. It's like even I was sliding back, but he was no match for the Winter Soldier. <laughs> like, oh my gosh, he just like. Hopefully, there's going to be a round two, maybe round three, who knows? Maybe Hopper, he can actually win the fight. If not, yeah, uh, it just, just, she's just out of your damn league. But you freaking see that, you know, Dustin, Steve, Robin is still freaking, you know, learning more and more about the freaking, you know, the hidden message behind the whole Russian thing, though. But seriously, it seems that Steve and Robin are going to be hooking up again by the end of this. Hopefully, unless she ends up dying, because it could just be the same thing where I was getting freaking, you know, accustomed to um, Bob previous seasons, I'm beginning to love him, and then they kill him off. It could be the same thing with Robin. <laughs> like, if she ends up dying, I'll be pissed. I'm like, damn, I'm just getting to, you know, getting used to her. Yeah, for, you know, freaking Dustin is getting used to her, liking her. Telling him, like, yo, Steve, you might as well just date her. But nope, Steve ain't with it. But it's just that end of trope thing. Unless it is going to turn the trope on its head. I'm like, nope, we fooled you. But honestly, cannot wait to see how this concludes this damn season. Like, oh, I don't know how many episodes I'm going to watch today. today. But till then, like her or dislike the video. Comment what you guys saw the episode. Hey, if you're new, please subscribe. I'm Fandom D Singh, and I am signing off.